A sweet, cream-filled snack first created just outside of Chicago. A man from Britain with a love for tossing things into a fryer. The two collided in Park Slope, Brooklyn, nearly two decades ago in what became the fried Twinkie. Christopher Sell had opened a fish and chip spot in the borough. He told the New York Times that the bodega nearby had a surplus of Twinkies, so he bought the sponge cake and threw it in the fryer. Add some berry sauce, and voila, the fried Twinkie. The fried pastry gained national attention as it started being served at fairs across the country. Marla Calico has seen her fair share of fried foods as the president and CEO of the International Association of Fairs and Expositions. She says the most popular things dunked in oil tend to be the foods high in fat. You'll still see deep-fried butter certainly out there, uh, and then you'll see the, some of the old traditional standbys like um, some deep-fried sweets, you know, deep-fried Oreos or Twinkies or things like that. They're still out there. People who can't make it to Brooklyn and don't want to wait for their local fair recently got a different way to enjoy the deep-fried Twinkie. Walmart decided to stock them in the frozen foods aisle. I'm Chris Venezia, WFUV News.